Okay, let's give her a shot. So I would do some small bendy circles and get her used to that. And the other way. A little bit more bendy in the neck. Yeah, there. Good. Now just keep her neck and her nose like that and push her hip to the right. Yeah. Less walking forward and more uh, sideways. You can just, if you pick up on that right rein and stop the forward motion a little bit and push her sideways. There you go, there you go, there you go. And walk forward. And real bendy neck. Good. Yeah, yeah, just like that. Just really bendy. And more nose, like over-exaggerated nose there. Good, and then ask for the hip again. Good, good. Yeah, bring the shoulders through now to the left. Good, good. And then walk forward to the in a right circle with a real bendy nose and neck. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit more bendy and yeah, forward. Good. Bendy, yeah, she, yeah, take your time. Good and bendy. She does not like that side so much, so just take your time and make her understand you're working with a new bit. Good, that's better. Good, and then just kind of hold her nose there and bring the hip around. Stop her, stop her forward with the left rein. Oh, good, good, yep. Yeah, that was a little more too much shoulders, not enough hip. your right leg to push the hip to the left. <laughs> right leg pushing the hip to the left. Yep. Good, good, good. And walk forward. Just like three steps. Don't get too crazy about it. Good. Keep softening that uh, right jaw. Really nice and soft. Good. And then push your hip over to the... Good. Good. Yep, yep, yep. And bring the shoulders through. Good. And then go down the wall and counter leg yield, or I don't know, whatever that Cody was calling it. Good. Don't lean to the left. Yeah. Use your hips to push her over and keep your upper body straight. Up. Try to put your right hip underneath your right shoulder and then ask. Yep. There. Good. Gives you more core strength. Good. Good. A little bit. You want to stop that right shoulder just a little bit. Yep. Good. There's, that's, that's better. Good. 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 And then walk on. So when you're doing that maneuver, you want her to kind of be straight through her straight through her body with just a little bit of bend in, in her pole so when you were doing it what was happening is she was pushing her shoulder out and then she was getting too bendy in the neck so just think of stopping that right shoulder a little bit so she has to use her body more instead of just kind of falling through there yeah good there good yeah good so I'll just like use my left leg and push her into that right rein which is stopping the shoulder yep get the hip around a little bit more yep you're twisting your body yep good hip around a little bit more yep. there good that like that like that like that use your left leg use your right leg and push into your right leg like your right leg is a wall there 
Use that to help support you. There you go. Use that right leg. It gives you more strength. Good. And walk forward. Good. And then you're going to go down the center line and you're just going to leg yield to the left. So you want to think of a straight horse going sideways. She can have a little bend in her pole. But that's it. Good. And going left. Your other left. <laughs> Good. So every time you use your right leg, you're going to just want to use a little bit of the left rein to stop the shoulder. Right leg, left rein. Think of getting her hips over to that wall before her shoulders. Yep. Hips to the wall. Yeah, just put your right leg back a little bit more. Good. There you go. Good. Good. Yeah. Yeah. Too much shoulder. Too much. Yeah. Good. Fix it. Good. Good. And go down the center line again. And leg yield to the left. Yep, straight horse going sideways. Yep, more hip. Think of getting that hip over there first. Think of, yeah, turn your, yeah, turn your body. There, good. Turn your body so you're stronger there. Yeah, good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good. It's okay, yeah. Yep. Good. Not so much rain. Put those reins down. Don't be pulling her around. You're going to piss her off. Good, yeah. Good. And then forward. And just finish your leg yield into the wall. Slow. Take your time. One step at a There. That was the best couple steps. Good. Good. And then just do a little loop and go back to your uh, counter leg yield on this wall. So a little loop back into this wall. Push her. Go, go towards F. And then at F, you're going to do the counter leg yield down the wall. Straight horse. Straight horse doing a lateral. Watch that shoulder. Yeah, watch that shoulder. Good. Oh, that just makes her stop when I just like, really, I can't bring my shoulder up. <laughs> it's hard, that's why. <laughs> so you, you got to make sure you don't hold her there, Diane. So you want to say, when you use your leg, you're going to use that rein. And then you're going to, yeah, use the rein, let her go. Yeah, there you go. Use the rain, let her go. Use the rain, let her go. Yep, good. That's better. That's better. Good. And then walk out of it. She's getting a little too... Uh -oh. Yeah. If she gets too sticky, just walk her out of it. Maybe trot her out of it and then go back to it instead of trying to push, you know... Yeah, yeah, because she's just going to be, I mean... And then you could just, and you could even try it at the trot a little bit if you know if you feel you're ready for it. Good, get get the angle more. Yeah, more angle. So her, yeah, more angle, less nose. Yeah, good, less nose. Yeah, good, and sideways. So touch her with the rain, let her go. Touch her with the rain, let her go. Touch her with the rain, let her go. Good, touch her. Good. Yeah, that's better than it has been. She's still a little too bent in the neck. There you go, good, good. And like when I look at your left leg, it's way off of her. I would use that left leg as an anchor. So when I'm pushing with my right leg, my left leg is, I'm pushing into my left leg, okay? So my left leg isn't really doing anything to the horse except supporting me. Yeah, okay. Because if you just do this, then you start leaning yep. and leaning. Yeah, let's do that one more time. And then we'll do a little bit more bendies. Good. Get the angle. Yeah. Use that left leg as your anchor. So push with your right leg into the... Yeah, good. Good. Yeah. Good. Good. Straighten her out and trot a few steps and then take her right back into that wall. 
Do a little circle to the left at B. Good. Try it a few steps. Get your angle and then go right back into it. Yeah, don't, don't get to punching and kicking on her. Get, just get that. There you go. Good. Good. Yeah. Good. Good. Yeah. Take your time. More hip. Yeah, more hip. There you go. Good. Good. And then trot her out of it. Good. So down this next wall, make her move out. Good. Yeah, I would post. Real big post. Real. Yeah, good. Good job. Good job. Yep, and collect her up on the short side. Good. Can you, you can post in the ranch, right? Right? Okay. And then down the long side forward again. Yep, push her. Yep, push her. Yep. Yep. So if you want to stay seated, you have to really get swingy with your hips. And you have to stay in a trot with your hips. So just try it. A couple steps. Swingy. Hands forward. Swingy, 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 swingy. Good. Better. Yeah, you're, you're, you're still, you're, you're staying a little too tight still. You're too tight. Yeah, you got to get, so 